welcome back to Riri's Nursery. Um, so happy Sunday, everyone. I'm coming back because I have a new Paradise Galleries doll I wanted to share with you guys. And um, just to kind of do a little catch up um, for the week, uh, because I do have, finally I got from my second uh, secret giveaway, my ha Happy Mail is gonna be sent off tomorrow. I spoke with um, that, that subscriber. And so that happy mail will be on its way. But my other subscriber, who um, uh, that's Black Lotus Reborn, her get her happy mail gift is already on its way to her. And so hopefully we'll be there sometime next week. Uh, with the weather and everything, it's been slow for a lot of people with deliveries. So hopefully it will make it in time. Um, so, but yes, I wanted to share this box opening with you guys. And then I have one more. I want let me show you another one before I open this one. Give me a second. So this little guy also came from Paradise Galleries. It was during their sale, and he was one of the um, the animal, you know, the, their products that were on sale. And I've been wanting these little dolls, um, the little doggies. They were done by Ping Lao. Um, so he is the, I think, the German Shepherd. So this is him, and uh, his paperwork is in his, his box still, which is in in my front, it's in the front room. So I will get that later I'm not worried about that right now but he comes you know as he's seen here with his little collar his little um, bandana that says who rescued rescued who and then this little sleeping mat and then a bottle isn't this so cute the milk you know disappearing bottles and then his mouth can fit it so if you want to give him his bottle now my daughter has tried to kidnap him from me my little four-year-old because she loves all things babies and so she's right there with me. So let's get to this one. So this is one of their new ones that came out and I was excited to get it at first. Or this taped here, let me cut that. At first I wasn't going to get her, but then I was looking at some of the video of her for, on their website. And I said, why not? You know, I wanna see, I wanna see how I like her. So let's get this open. Oh, she is cute. So she is the Swan Princess. And she's not a, she's a big girl. Pretty blue eyes. She comes with this swan, her, which is her lovey. It's pretty. So it's a white swan with pink feathers. <laughs> and then it has the gold crown on the head and the beak is gold as well. And then the eye area is pink. So pink and white. And then she also has her Nunu, her pacifier, it's magnetic, so she can take a magnetic pacifier, as you can see. So let's get her out so everyone can get a look at her. her out. She has a cute little outfit on, so she's wearing, it looks like a white ribbed bodysuit that has a swan on the front. Um, no, her, um, her ribbon is around her neck really tight, you guys. So give me just a second. Let me get, get that off of her. Okay, so we're back. Um, her The ribbon had gotten caught underneath her neck. So I went ahead and took everything off. And here she is with her little swan. Um, so like I was saying, this is the Swan Princess. She is number 258 in the edition. Um, you know, their dolls are open until they're not. <laughs> so she's just number 258. So let's look at her. So um, what I loved about this doll, she does have rooted hair. So I did like that they, um, that she came with rooted hair. And um, then she's got this white ribbed top with the pink, all pink swan on the front with this little golden crown. Uh, the, this is actually a, just a shirt. So underneath she's got her cloth body and then she's wearing a diaper. So they have her with a diaper on which is nice that she came with one. Um, I like the, the how her hands are sculpted. So she's got nice little um, movement in the hand that you can kind of put your thumb in there, finger over here. So she looks like she could, you know, hold your hand. She's got nice sized feet. So as you can see, she has some really nice sized feet. I think that's nice. And pretty blue eyes. And I just love her face. She's really, really cute. Um, so I was, you know, I'm excited. It's a nice purchase. I really like her. So, you know, if you were thinking about this one, I think she would be a lovely one to add to your collection. 
I also wanted to share her with you guys and I guess she feels really good. Great movement. You can see she kind of folds really easy, so she has good movement. Um, I wanted to talk about my um, 1,000 subscriber giveaway and how she correlates. Well, when I make 1,000 subscribers, I have decided I wanted to do a giveaway of a doll and I thought what doll would I would like to give away? I wanted it to be her. I knew that I really loved her pictures um, when I saw on the website. So I, I went ahead and ordered and said this will be the giveaway baby. Now, it won't be her specifically. I went ahead and ordered a second one. So, ta-da, here we go. And as you can see here, Swan Princess. Is it upside down? <laughs> Let me see, yeah. So there she goes, Swan Princess. So that will be the giveaway baby. Um, and so I hope that, it, you know, wh whoever does win, you know, as long as you're a subscriber, um, you're over 18 for that, uh, for the giveaway. Um, I hope that you like Paradise Gallery dolls. She's a good size. Um, let me see who her artist is. I can tell you. So her artist is Jane Wright. This is who created her. And um, she's, you know, one of their newest ones. And they've made a couple of new ones these last couple of months. Uh, but she really caught my eye, and so I like her. And like I said, she she really feels good. Nice size. So I think she's, she would probably be a good zero to three months, if not three months. But she's a good size. And I also wanted to say, um, I if, if anyone watched my other surprise giveaway vi video, I had two um, people who I picked. They were my first two commenters. So Black Lotus Reborn was the first one. Her gift is on its way. And then... Ray's Reborn Love was second. I talked to her this weekend, so hers will be going out tomorrow on Monday. And I'm just excited. So because of that, I decided I wanted to do two when I make a thousand subscribers. And so I had already decided on what that second uh, giveaway baby was going to be. And it is Little Man, my Little Man. So I had bought two of these when this doll had first come out with Paradise Galleries. And I was excited because I loved, I still, this is, you know, a favorite of mine. Um, and so I, I was like, well, since I was getting a new doll in, that's why I, the, my rule is new doll in, a doll out for my Paradise Gallery. So I don't get too overwhelmed with them. Um, I said, well, who's going to go in my collection? Normally I would sell them on Macari or something, but I figured why sell it when I can just give it away to a subscriber who would also love my little man. So we've got these two. That will be up when it's, when I make a thousand, but one will be in a box. Um, this one will um, will be in a box too because I still keep the box. I hold on to several boxes of my Paradise Galleries because I know my rule of one in, one out. Um, so, uh, he, my little man will come with the COA, of course, the original outfit that came with him, um, and this one as well. So that way, if the new mommy wanted to change, uh, keep it as a girl, you got an outfit. Or if not, I guess you can you can pass this down uh, to one of your other dollies because it, it's a newborn size. And I just kept the shoes that, that um, came with the sculpt. So these would be our two that will be going for the giveaway when I make a thousand. Um, so after this, I'd like to do a little change and chat. A little quick change and chat with you guys. Uh, and so I'll be right back. Let me get them out of here. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, friends. So I'm back. I wanted to do a little... Quick changing with my little Finn. I have been enjoying him immensely. Um, he is close to my bed at all times. Um, I am so in love with this little guy. You know, one thing I love to the most about him uh, is his size. Um, my youngest was a preemie, and she was this exact size, 17 inches, and she had just hit five pounds. <laughs> And so he's 4.4, but not too far off. He's a solid, obviously, four pounds, so it feels a little heavier. And so his size just makes me think of when she, those first few weeks of her life um, and a few months because it took her a minute to get out of preemie clothes, but not too long and before she got fattened up because she was a good eater. Um, but, you know, I when I saw him, I was just like, oh, my God. I just love his size and I'm, I'm drawn to the little one. So I wanted to do this video 
just to bring him back on for you all to see him and to change him. I'm gonna change him into this little outfit. I got this gown off of Macari and it's a vintage Winnie the Pooh. And I love all things Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> so I had, when I saw that, I was like, that's gonna be for my baby. It is a newborn size. Let me make sure it does say newborn. Yes, and actually it says zero to three, but it doesn't look that big. But that's what I'm gonna put on him. Let me get him in. Um, but I also wanted to just show, you know, show a little bit of him. So as you can see, he's got good movement. Um, it's so nice the way he moves his head to move from side to side real easily. Um, he's got great leg movement. Uh, his proportions, uh, that's another thing I love too, is he has really good proportions. And so it's really nice that he's not like too stubby in legs or in the arms that everything is just right for this baby. He's just so, so cute. Oh my gosh. And Ashton did a really great job with, uh, with painting him. Now his artist, he had a different artist that rooted his hair. Now Ashton is fabulous at rooting, but for this one, she did partner with someone else. I'm going to put the name on the screen. Um, Cause off the top of my head, I can't remember the artist name that did the rooting, but she did an amazing job with his hair. Um, I just want to show you his tummy. His little, as you can see, his little, that's not a squishy, but it's a nice size, it's a nice tummy. So we've got his stomach. So as you can kind of see, <laughs> there's some, there's details, but I've been wanting to do a video, um, a details video with him and with my Gabriel, but it has been raining gloomy <laughs> for about a week or so now. So I cannot do that yet. So I will come back on when we have really good weather and I can um, show you all, you know, show you a good detailed video of him, but I wanted to just bring him back on. I love this little squish. Oh my gosh, he is just, oh, and I've decided to give him a middle name. I don't know, I'm just obsessed with him. So I decided to do a, a middle name and his name, his middle name is a Brannigan. He is Finn Brannigan. I, middle name, not last, he, that's his middle name. So he is Finn Brannigan. Uh, he is so cute. Uh, I'm gonna insert a picture because you're not gonna see this, but it with, with his ear canals are even are even detail. I, I don't think it'll show. Let me see if I can get close to the camera and see if you would see that there's detailing in the ear. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna take a picture and then I'll add it. But let's get him into his little gown. Now I like that the gown is bigger too because of the fact that I don't wanna be pulling things over his head if I can avoid it, just to protect his hair. And there we go. What I do when I go um, through the sleeve is I put, make sure I put the hand inside like, to, like a claw and that way I pull the material over my hand. That's why I like if the outfit is, a, you know, if it is a little bigger, I'm fine with that. Um, it doesn't have to fit perfectly snug, so that way I'm not rubbing harshly over the silicone itself, and my babes is protected. So I just hold on like a claw, put their hand in there, and pull over. And then this has like its own little mitt, so I just take the material and fold it over to protect his hands. All right, so the hands are put, protected. And then I got something else off of Macari. I have found these pacifiers, so they've got the silicone nipple, but I'm not gonna put it in his mouth, but I wanted it to just go. So I think I'm gonna do the white with the yellow little trim. Let me get that open. Okay, so there we go. Um, and it's cute, it comes with this little, little cap to protect it, oops, <laughs> like that. Um, but that's cute though, so that way if you wanted to, you can protect your, the nipple. So let me get his old pacifier off of here. There we go. Let's see, where do I wanna snap this? I don't wanna, I don't like to have it too close to the face. Let's put it down here at the bottom. So there we go, so he's got his Winnie the Pooh pacifier. There we go. 
So we got his Winnie the Pooh pacifier and his little Winnie the Pooh outfit on. Look how cute. <laughs> so precious. Because normally I would clip it up here, but I just don't want it near his face. So we've got that. And it'd be cute for pictures so that he can be matchy matchy <laughs> for pictures. Um, so, yes, yeah, so I wanted to do a little, little change in chat with him. And, you know, the box opening for my little Swamp Princess, which I don't know what I want to name her yet, so I'll think of something for her name. She is so cute. She's really cute. Um, so, yeah, so that's our video today. So, you guys, again, I hope everyone's having a good weekend. Um, I hope everyone out there is excited that we'll want to enter the giveaway when I hit a thousand subscribers for the the chance of winning this little beauty here and and my little man. Um, let me let me put little man put her back into the video. Um, I had named her uh, uh, Sarah, so you know. But my my boy is Samuel. But you know, if this is like I said, whoever wins, this will be a boy or a girl for you. Um, as you see, I am relaxing on this Sunday. I've got my coffee lover sweater and my plaid bottoms. I'm comfortable. And, and just enjoying some time changing babies and making videos. Um, but I hope everyone's having a good weekend and excited about the giveaway possibilities out there. And until next time, I would, can't, I'm hoping for better weather this upcoming week so I can do a real details and some good lighting um, to show off. Uh, my little Finn Brannigan here, and then also for Gabriel. I want to do a detailed video for him as well. Uh, so I hope everyone's having a good one, and until next time, bye-bye uh, from all of us here at Riri's Nursery, everyone. So good night.